everybody welcome back to being the odds it is monday january 15 2024 we are back with our nba best bets of the day if you're new to the channel my name is zach and welcome to being the odds Hit that subscribe button like this video and notification bell so you never miss a pick we post these nba videos every single day along with the nba uh, so along with the nfl college basketball and nhl we're also gonna have a big winning year in the mlb and college football as well we're going after our first 15,000 subscribers, our first 11 months on YouTube. Really excited to have you all here. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. So to recap yesterday's results, we had a good day. Went 2-1 yesterday. Members lose the Nuggets minus 10 half versus Indiana. I'm going to stay away from any Indiana game until Halliburton gets back because they're playing pretty damn well as far as spread goes. Uh, we had the over 247.5 Milwaukee and Sacramento. I think they scored 285 points. Big dub there. And then T-Wolves plus two. Uh, they're winning the whole game. You'll love to see it. So overall for the year, 156 and 115 on a hell of an NBA run right now. And we have five picks today in the NBA. We have five. Three I'm going to give you guys here on YouTube. Two I'm going to uh, two I have for members only for the NBA. I also have three members only in the NFL, one in the college basketball. You get all this at ZDMBest.com slash picks. As a member, you get all our members only plays every single day, which most profitable best bets on a day-to-day -day basis. On top of that, you have a direct line to me. So any game you're considering betting, reach out to our hotline number, get a guaranteed response back about any game you're considering betting. And you get all our free picks too on YouTube, sent to you before these videos come out. That would take advantage of early lines, early odds. It looks at zdmbets.com slash picks, zdmbets.com slash picks, zdmbets.com slash picks. So let's get into the plays we have today for the NBA. I'm going to start with our first play. It's going to be 76ers minus 7.5 versus the Rockets. And B it will, could be playing today. And if he does, defensively, the Rockets don't have a matchup for him. Alperin Zangun is a very strong offensive player. He is not good on defense, especially when you have to go against the reigning MVP. Also, um, they don't really have much of an answer for Maxi either. I don't think many teams do. Uh, Maxi is a budding star, maybe even a superstar here very shortly. And especially at home, this dude is absolutely electric. And on top of that, Rockets don't really have much of a matchup for Tobias Harris either. Jail and also, the Rockets are not good on the road. Philly is great at home, and Philly also is 24 and 13 against the spread this year. I really like the 76ers here to blow out the Rockets early on MLK Day. Next, we're going to go to a TNT game. We're going with the Spurs plus eight versus the Hawks. The Spurs get up for games like this. They don't want they don't want their team to be seen as a laughing stock of the NBA as they've been the last few years. Um, Atlanta is also pu very publicly talking about blowing the team up. And other than Jalen Johnson and Trey Young, that's a big deal, especially with DeJounte Murray being their second best player. I can see him being a little slighted here. And on top of that, the Spurs, like I said, they, I think when Vignana, he is really coming into his own. Obviously, everyone knows, oh, he's one of the best prospects since LeBron, of course. But I'm saying, like, he's really coming to his own. I mean, he matched up with Giannis, like, the last time I watched him play. The Shark Bunny's all over the Spurs here today versus the Hawks. And really, I just don't trust this Hawks team. If you're going to give them eight points, I, I mean, you're, I have to lay eight points to cover this. I, I would not touch that with a 10-foot pole. I'm all the Spurs here, plus eight versus the Hawks. And then we we'll go with the Nets, minus two versus the Heat. Hawkins is out, which is a big deal. The Heat are not a good regular season team. They just don't play well um, in the regular season. And the Nets here, man, they, they, they're, you know, I, I like them here in this spot. They're at home. You know, Mikhail Bridges, I think, is the best regular season player on the court. That includes Bam, that includes Jimmy, regular season-wise, not postseason. Um, I, I think the Nets will be up for this game. The Heat just feel like a stale team to me. I'm rolling the Nets here, minus two. Now, like I said, we have two members only plays I love in the NBA, along with six members only plays in total. I really, really like the card today. Um, you get the ZDMBets.com slash picks website in the comments below. But a quick recap, we have, we have 76ers minus seven and a half. We have Spurs plus eight. We have Nets minus two. So let's go lock on those picks. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. I'll see you all tomorrow. Make sure I'll check those other videos.